So it is my pleasure today to introduce Johnny as the head chef and uh, Mr. Singh, the owner of this brand new restaurant. And uh, you know, they had this, they got my attention the other day, I was walking by and I saw a little sign that said, Samosas, 10 for seven ninety five, And I thought, gee, that's a pretty good deal. Mm -hmm. So I bought some, I took them home and you know, my wife and I both loved them. They were just amazing and I thought, you know, Maple Ridge needs to know about this restaurant. So, do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Yeah, no okay, problem. So, so, you know, describe your business, really. Tell, tell me what it's all about. I mean, you appear to be a takeout type restaurant. Yeah, we, we are a takeout restaurant, uh, but we have little uh, space for the dining, too. So, and we, are, we specialized in authentic Indian cuisine, in, which is specially uh, derived from the basic parts of interiors of India, like North India, South India, in some part of Northeast also. Okay. So I've been um, living in India, born and brought up over there and almost 30, 14 years of experience of uh, the restaurant line over there. So when I came here, I would find, especially Maple Ridge, uh, the something, the flavor was missing here. The authentic flavor of the Indian food, East Indian food, it was a little missing here. So when I experimented my original curries and my touch of my flavors here with the Maple Ridge clients, they love it. And that you can just go to Google and see the reviews in the last seven months. So people really appreciated my job, my work, and they're liking it. Yeah, no, it's uh, uh, we love the food. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you so much. Really good. Good. Day, good. Day, so good. 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 So, so, you know, what made you decide to open this business here in Maple Ridge with Indian food? Other than the fact that you said already that uh, that you know you felt some of the flavor was missing. Yeah, yeah, the flavor was missing. Actually, uh, this area people now uh, the uh, our community, the Indian community, the Asian community, they're. Mostly the ratio of people most in the inside. Mm -hmm. And now slowly and gradually for the last couple of years, people are moving to this side. Yeah. So when I review that, a lot of people are moving from Surrey to the side because so it's a nice place, small, neat, clean, and obviously a little cheaper than uh, Surrey. So yeah. living expenses are lesser than Surrey over here. So people are moving to this place. So I find that the community is moving, the Asian community is moving. So there must be demand for the Indian food, the you know, the Asian food here. So that made me come here and start the business here. Well, no, that's uh, that's really good. Just to serve the community. <laughs> to serve the community. Yeah. So, so you do you do delivery too? Yeah, we 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 are about to start the delivery in uh, March in summers. Okay. Because winters it's rainy and so so, and we are doing skip the dishes. And Uber Eats, you know, online. We have to do okay. three packets for food delivery. Good. Yeah. You no, know, that that's great. Um, we're going to use you for that. Yeah, thank you. For delivery, yeah. So, you know, so far, what has surprised you most about opening a new restaurant? Surprise. There, there are challenges. You know, yeah. uh, that it takes time uh, to because this is a word-to-mouth publicity business. So, Doc, you, you came to me as a client and you worked samosas from me. You went back home, enjoyed that in, in your family. So, you, you will definitely you recommend my place to someone else. Yes. So, it takes a little time. It's a little slowly, a slowly upgrowing business. But, thanks to God, our graphs are going upwards. Yeah. So, we are very positive about that. No, I'm... Um, uh, so, you know... What are th some things that people don't really know about Indian food? <laughs> a lot of things, a lot yeah. of things, there are a lot of things. Any, anything really that stands out? You know, the people who came to Canada almost 30, 40, 50 years ago from India, so they were not exactly the chefs or they were not the cooks, they were the basic people who, you, who knows little of cooking. Yeah. And they started making things in open restaurant. People from that time, who gradually to who were moved from Asian countries or India, Pakistan, they they didn't find any more options, so they they tend to make the same taste. But nowadays, the educated people are coming, the people from the guys from hotel management, the chefs, the head chef from Taj, 
from Mauritius, from, from the good brands from India, they are moving here. Mm -hmm. So they are they are creating new things. They are giving the right taste to people. Yeah. So that's what I'm trying to do. Well, that's wonderful. So you know, why did you choose this location or this this area? Because uh, this, especially this plaza, this has three restaurants. So I believe where you have the business, where you have the food business, jump into that. But you have already a walking client. So you don't need to create new place or new market for you. Yeah. This is already a market. You know, Chinese restaurant, Donair, Korean. Yeah. Yeah. All the poor restaurants. Are no, I agree. People have that. choices. They do. Yeah. They really, they really do. So. And it's the Lohit Highway. It's the most yeah. running highway. So I mean, one of the having other restaurants in the area is a big deal because you know it brings people here. Yeah, it's more it does. You know, it makes sense. So. You know, what do you want to see improved in this neighborhood? Just looking around, what would you like to see? You know, that would, might help you in your business. A little more parking. Yeah. A little more parking. No more parking. Because uh, we have a realtor nearby, so till afternoon it's full of parking. My clients, you know, sometimes it's difficult for my client to get parking in it. Rest, uh, this, the, we have good neighbors in the blue white spot. It's all food, 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 all around. So people come here. So one day is my client goes to A W. Some day A W client comes to me. It's okay. It's good. It's good. Everything is good about this place. Yeah, no, it's a good that's, choice. That's good. So you know, do you think you know? Obviously, all of us are trying to get people to shop locally. You know, to deal with you know restaurants in their neighborhood and, and grocery stores and so on. So, so I really personally appreciate the fact that you're here. Thank you so much, Doc. You know, I, I think that that's really good. I'm a huge supporter of, of entrepreneurs and local business and, and so on. I think it's very, very important that, that we have these things here. So, you know, just uh, I don't want to tie everybody up here a little bit for the whole afternoon, but just a, a quick thing about, you know, we've got a pictures of your menu up here. It looks like you've got a big selection of, yeah. of items up on your menu. and. Uh, they seem to be pretty well priced. Yep. Okay. And, uh, Since starting of the business, we have kept the price up to the market. Yeah. Uh, not lower because we are doing a good quality business. Yeah. So and not too higher. So that we just want our clients to taste our food, appreciate that. Slowly and gradually, we will build up the market. So what's what's the best way to to phone ahead of time and have it ready to pick up? Yeah, it's always we have uh, two three options. So number one option is like you just call my restaurant. Yeah. Place the order. Usually, we give thirty to forty minutes time for the pickup. Okay. And number two option is we we have an online. So you yeah. just go online, place your order. I'll get a fax from the company. So I'll, you just may need to mention your pickup timing, your taste, your, you want to what spice you like, what any 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 extra things you want to add in or mm -hmm. take out. So we just do it and, and same time. It's twenty to twenty five minutes for the pickup time. Okay. So I was on 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 the web and I saw your other locations, but I didn't see this location there yet. Is this going to be coming up there very soon? Yeah, because we are new to the market, so we just updating it and on day by day. So okay. we're coming up soon, and that's why you were here. Yeah. <laughs> just to, just to help with that. Yeah. So, so I uh, you know I looked at your little menu here. It's it's a wonderful menu. You know, it's got everything that you could possibly imagine in here in Indian food and, yeah. and you know, it's some Western food as well. So, I mean, there's, there's some choices in here. But, you know, what really got my attention was your special spend. Ten samosas for seven ninety five. Yeah. You know, that that's the hot favorite of my all Canadian fellow, my, my, my clients. They love samosas and that's why we have a deal. Because usually, uh, there are three, four, two restaurants who are serving samosas that Dollar fifty or dollar seventy five, and we're selling for two dollars. So that's the most eatable food here, selling with the most common people. It's a good snack. So we have kept that price a little low. That we want to spread that uh, things, the flavor to the clients. Okay. That's the easiest way. Small yeah. amounts, big bundle, and goes to ten people. Yes, absolutely. So spread is like anything. It's spreading it out. Well, it is. Uh, ten people get to try. It. Yeah. You know, makes sense to me. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's a very good idea. So, anyway, you know, I'm I'm very happy we had this little time together, just oh, to wow. able to share oh, some, my of this, yeah. some of this with you. So I would encourage you, please come by, give Sangam a try. I know that you'll be happy with the food. This is Doc Livingston, EXP Realty, and we'll see you next time.
Bye bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Okay.